Hey, it's me, Troy from Scare Hollow. And yeah, I got this thing on my head. Because it's hot out here. Let's see if the sun actually puts light on my face. Hey, no? No? Let's see. Oh, 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 there's some good sun. Anyways, hey, so it's hot outside, but not too hot. It's like 85, but when you're standing in it, it's, oh, I burped. I shed some soda. So to show you how serious I am about this hearse thing is that I haven't had anything to eat since breakfast. Mm -hmm. I haven't, I haven't. So I'll take it off so you can see my face. So, um, so, so far, here's what I've got. I've got some panels painted. So, <clears throat> some people have made um, the comments in the past, not you guys, but um, that this is really nice plywood. See, really nice, nice plywood. And this is that crappy, you know, press board stuff. Well, <clears throat> there's some, really, some more nice plywood. So the reason that I did the two different kinds which I can't even see, there we go, is, uh, I'm not gonna use that. But it's because of the fact that I, um, I want a little stronger wood for where the seat's gonna go, because I wanna sit on it. And so, um, <clears throat> I want to be able to, you know, the other wood is a little thinner. So I don't wanna use that wood to mount the, the, uh, the seat to. So, anyways. Look, 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 I have pumpkins. There's a pumpkin. There's a pumpkin. I need a weed. No, I don't have weed, I need two weed. Another pumpkin. And then, what? Look it, I have the last one. Did, who'd you ask? You asked you? Mommy. And what did mommy say? Did she? Well, Mommy said okay, you could have that. Well she, well, she didn't say anything. Oh, she didn't say anything, but she didn't say no? Well, I asked her that and she didn't answer. I asked her, can I have this, but she didn't answer. Mm -hmm. I, think I, I think I asked her. <laughs> My son. Go ask her. I say no because you don't need sugar. Are you filming? Uh-huh. Is Logan on field? He was. Nope. And look, this one, I got this one too. This one was up here. It was up there. It was stuck all inside the little things and stuff like tomatoes. Anyways, you wanna see how I garden? Let's see how I garden. See, look at that. That's a bag. And there's dirt in there. And then I put the stuff inside there. I just pulled a bunch of zucchini out of here. There's another one. He's not looking too good. He's squishy. You can eat the red ones if you want. No. Yeah, they're just tomatoes. Just regular tomatoes. Honey. Cherry tomatoes. There's green beans in there too. You can eat those too. You can pull them right out. Look at the one. Yeah, look at them. Or you can eat the small ones. Okay. So I got green beans. I got peppers. There's no more peppers on there. I need this one. Okay. See, green beans. Look at that green bean. Mm, that's so yummy. Logan, you better come eat these green beans. Oh, look at this one. Look at that one. That's big. It's as big as my finger. Anyways, I haven't really taken it. Oh, look, there's a zucchini right there. Look at that one. That's right, I got some huge ones. Oh, look at these tomatoes. Look at that one. Look at that. Juicy. Juicy, juicy. So, um, as you can tell, I've been having problems with moles. This is where the pool was, but there's a mole holes. There's mole holes right there. I'm poking them to see if I can get them to come out. There, get them to poke a new hole. All this dirt, all was out of mole hills. All this. So I got all this and all that and all that. Yeah, that's all out of mole hills. I got a lot of moles. I actually, I think I only have one, and I'm gonna try to get them. And I've got them before. See, I've got my trap. I got my trap right there. Look at that thing. 
thing's gonna kill him. Anyways, it's killed him before. Not him because he's still alive, but so <clears throat> now I have a panel. Yay, panel. So um, I'll show you. So what I had to do was see if you notice over here, see how tall that is to where the connecting point is? Yeah, I had to make it go all the way down there. So this one I cut down to there. So now it fits just perfectly. So we'll mount this to this, and then this can come off whenever I want. There's already holes drilled, it's so awesome. Can I find that hole going in the board? No, but we'll see. Anyways, okay. So we'll be back with some more in a little bit. So I don't know, I think I already had the bottom down, but so I wanted to show everybody what I had done with how I did all these different, you know, how I bolted all this down. This thing's super solid, huh? Look at, look at, look at this two or one inch square tube all bolted down. Look at bolts, 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 bolts everywhere. It looks awesome. So, but when I, what I figured out was originally when I thought that the space between here and here with the space of this would have accounted for the width of this but it does not. So what I need to do is I need to unbolt these, which is gonna suck, unbolt these and move it in. I have to cut this, cut it out of here. I could have cut this whole lengthwise, but that would have, un that would have taken a lot of strength out of it. So I'm going to notch this and then I'm gonna shove this in to about halfway. And that should make it so that this, the post that sits in here, and then see, because if you notice, this is what I'm doing. So see, that's the part I could not get this to attach to the wood. There was uh, there was about that much gap between it. So I want it to lay flat, so I can attach it all like this. And then see, hence why I had to make two windows is because the bar goes down the middle of the window there. Anyways. So, but I did want to show everybody how I did this part was that I just basically went along and took the one one inch square tubing that was already welded up in this TL shaped fashion. Look, I even have more if I want to make more mistakes. Ah. So, um, yeah, so I'm gonna move these and we'll do a little better. Okay, so oh, this is really bad lighting back here. Oh, hey, there I am. <laughs> um, so, um, just another quick little question. Um, yeah, see, I've got my light back there. Back there. Back there, yeah. And, uh, so, yeah. So, I got, finally got pizza. So, I had breakfast this morning, like, at 10 or 9 or something like that. I don't remember what time it was. And then I had some cookies. And then I had pizza. Pizza! Um, <clears throat> so I was out here drilling, you know. Drilling, drilling, drilling. I'm remounting the pieces because what I had to do was I couldn't notch it out. Because I realized after I said I was going to notch it out, this whole piece goes along with it. I can't just notch out that section right there because it would have went in. So I had to cut. So this is all bolted, so it's still pretty solid. Blah blah blah. Anyways, this is all going to be covered soon once again. Anyways, so <clears throat> but in the process, so you see the handle of the drill. You know, it's all kind of. Look at that. I don't know what's on there. Anyway, so you see how they, you know, it's a little rough, you know, but it's nice, nice and comfortable. Well, <clears throat> I had a blister, so you could see it. So, um, so the blister popped because it was rubbing on there. It was, you know, well, sorry. So I guess right there, I guess. So it kept rubbing, kept rubbing, kept rubbing, and finally it popped. Well, okay, so my question to you guys is, I used that leaf right there to wipe off the water that comes out of a blister. Nah. So, have any of you guys used anything weird to wipe off your blister water? Yeah, I know. I hope you're all eating, but there's blister water. Anyway, so, um, I also want to let you know that last night we did have um, a uh, the Haunted Ghost Town here in Portland had a movie night, and we watched Texas Chainsaw Massacre, the 
my 2012 version, I think it was, uh, before the 3D version, um, which was like 30 years after story. Anyways, um, this was just kind of a retelling of the original story um, or another version of it. Anyways, so you guys have seen the one with uh, 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 Jessica Biel. Yeah where it like shows her boobs like the whole time well not her actual boobs but like you can totally tell they made an effort to only highlight her boobs in the in the uh in the uh in the video you know with the white the, with the white shirt and then like four or five times there was water on it and it's like well that's obvious but anyways and then after that they show sinister one because sinister two comes out on august 21st which is like this saturday friday and so they had Sinister Two people, uh, a, a, a lady there, a street team lady, um, was there, and she was giving out cool swag. And I'll do this on another vlog because it has to do with the hearse, but she gave me a very cool um, <clears throat> clear panel that has the Sinister face. And if you notice, it's, you know, you know the, the long hair and the weird eyes and everything like that. Well... Um, so she gave me that and what it is is it's lenticular so but it's kind of a different kind of lenticular is that what you do is when you when you're looking at it straight dead on there's nothing there when you turn it to the side it shows the face so I will show it once I get the windows up on the vlog up on the hearse because I want to put it in one of the windows and I think that would be so cool is that if you're walking by the hearse that face as you walk by it, you're like, oh, oh, and then and then you look straight at it, and it's gone. So I told Lydia and Sinister that, and she's like, oh, you should totally take a picture of it or a video of it when you're done, so we can put it up on their website. So they want to put it up on the Sinister Two, you know, Facebook page, which, which is pretty cool. So if you see during my vlogs, you'll see the little the little thing, and it says, it says, Sinister Two, be careful, children at play. Nah, children at play. Yeah. So, um, so that was last night. It was all at the Haunted Ghost Town in Portland. It's over in Park Rose. Um, and um, they do their haunt in October. I think they're open 15 or 16 nights this year. Um, so I'll put up a little thingy on there, on the bottom down there. But um, yeah, they're very cool. They're very, they asked me about my haunt. They asked me if I was doing my walkthrough. And I said, no. And they said, oh. And I said, but I'm doing this play, but that also means that I get to go visit everybody. So um, they did mention kind of a haunter's caravan that I was thinking about putting together for October to see if we get a bunch of people to just get like get in a van and just drive around. So um, we also know somebody with a hearse. Maybe we could pile in the back of the hearse. So we'll see. But go to five, six different haunts around here. So it seems like at least them, being a pro haunt, they want to accommodate us. So I think that they'll just say, hey go on through so um i think there's i know house of shadows will let us do that um and i know that um i'm i'm pretty sure that maybe fright town might let us if we go early in the season so which is kind of my plan maybe go early in the season um give people a time to do you know maybe like the second weekend in october do it um because then we can let people do and then if we want to do a home haunt one later on too we can do that but you know anyways so i think because I'm not going to get done with this till later on tonight till it's too dark to take video. So I will finish up what I'm doing tonight because hopefully if I can get these all drilled because I've I've got the other two mounted and I just got to move this one and I'm almost done mounting that one. When I'm done mounting that one, I am going to affix both sides as of right now of the windows because I've already done the one. I just need to drill them in with the drill and stuff like that. So that should handle that. And then I think I'll try to put on the front. And you're seeing my face right now because I'm realizing that I think I didn't cut. I didn't cut it right for what I wanted to do, but I can do what I wanted to do the first time. So because I needed to overlap the corners because the sides just come to the corner Oh no. Yeah. So I need it to overlap the corners a little bit because then I can use that to screw in to the other corners and stuff like that. So I think it'll be fine. We're going to add some trim to each corner and we're going to add trim to a round because if you notice, I'll show you. Um, let's see. Stupid screw. So I'll have probably a screw there and 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 a screw there. See, I already got the hole. That's that's different screw. Different screw. Different screws. Different screws. Anyways, so um, 
we're gonna add some trims, all kinds of stuff to it, to make, I'm gonna go back under my easy up here so you can see me. And, um, oh, the sunshine. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna add some trim around those to make sure that those all go away so we don't see any screws, screws or anything. Um, so we'll do that and um, I think this is good progress. I'm hoping to have two of the walls up tonight and then I can continue on there for the rest of the week. It's supposed to be only like 90 tomorrow but then like 100 on Tuesday and 100 on Wednesday and then 80s after that. So, and I've got pretty much all weekend. I have a birthday party to go to on Saturday for my buddy James. Um, and so um, after that, I should on either side of that birthday party and doing so I might go golfing on Sunday. I don't know yet, but I want to. Um, and then, um, but yeah, I have every night during the week, so hopefully I can get everything cut up because I can't really do major cutting back here because of the, um, because of the close proximity. See, there's, there's a house right there. And then my house. And that's Elizabeth's room and that's Logan's room. And so, um, try to come to my house, I'll kill you. Um, and, um, so... I can't really cut anything hardcore. So if I need to cut something, I can go out in the front. But I'm still, the neighbors are really close and stuff like that. So I try to do all my cutting during the day, um, early evening, and then be done. So, I think there's somebody back there right now. I can hear the water. So, haunt on. Scare Hollow out. So, I don't know if you can see those. Wait, maybe if I go... That's the moles. He covered up all three holes that I made already. I'm gonna get him, I swear. Ah.